man. People always say, oh, why are you play semi-pro? But it's just the love of the game. One, two, three, it's one! For those who can't quit the game. I just like playing. Even if they own the team. Actually, I haven't hung it up yet. You haven't? Okay. Yeah, yeah. For those especially born here. The Children's Mercy, room 123. The Kansas City Bulldogs. Be quick to the ball, understand? Yes, sir. Is where football doesn't stop. Go right, go right. Everybody's ready for football season to start. And we've been around. We've been playing ball since April. In so many different ways, this roster has come together. Kind of stumbled upon it. I was like, well, let me go ahead and get out here and try it out. And... I've been stuck here since. <laughs> and what began in 2007 has grown. It has changed a lot. We started as eight man. Everybody to the ball, right here. We've had a strong core the last few years, 25 to 30 guys since we went 11 man. Some, like Gabe Frank, are pushing 40 or older. Others as young as 18. They don't play ball right out of high school and they come here and then they go to college. We have players that have never played football before. Uh, that were boxers. But there are also players like wideout Trevay Jones. He's had NFL tryouts with both the Texans and Chiefs. Just trying to work, you know, get back to the, you know, the NFL. He's like, why don't you come out for the Bulldogs? I was like, okay. The semi-pro cliche, you just show up and play. Um, that, that separates us. Time and money spent on practice and travel has led to winning. That keeps players coming back. Nobody gets paid to be here. You actually pay to be here. A lot of players, we have to talk to our girlfriends and wives <laughs> and try to persuade them, hey, I want to do this. And a lot of times you get that support system. Here's what matters. Out of roughly 1,200 teams across the country, the Bulldogs rank 12th. And as they pursue another Midwestern Football Alliance title. This has been the only time I've been able to host a trophy. It's the most beautiful thing. They've also arrived at the point where they're now chasing something much greater. And that's our goal. Uh, for that national championship game. Being able to represent Kansas City and what that would mean to a lot of people. I see guys on, on social media saying, I'm a Bulldog for life. I mean, it makes me real proud. <laughs> <laughs> a sense of brotherhood. That's a key component to sustaining existence in this league. But for the KC Bulldogs. It's all for the love of the game. There's nothing sweeter than victory. Still working and hopefully we can bring you guys a championship. Yeah, Amy, they've won two MFA titles. That's regional, but they're hoping to make a run at nationals. We'll see as that unfolds this fall. What a great story, Tom. Thank you so much for that. That was great.